Hello Gemini, how are you doing guys? Welcome to my channel, I'm Miss Rose and this is Miss Rose Tarot. I am really happy that you're here for your general reading for the month of February 2022, Gemini. Sun Moon Rising and Venus Placements. This is for you guys. So we're going to have a look what's going on in your life in general. What needs more attention? What needs to be brought up to the surface or from your subconsciousness? What are messages Spirit wants to tell you? Okay. Love related messages. Career abundance. Other personal relationships. Let's just see what pops out for you. Okay. Wow. <laughs> these are spirit animals energies for you and i'm very jealous already because you got the lizard and some of you guys know i'm a huge massive the doors fan but most of all because i do write poetry a lot i love jim morrison because he was such an amazing poet and he called himself the lizard king as you most of you might know so i'm jelly love that number 38 lizard spirit Dream the world into being. Extremely, extremely powerful energy. We have the koala spirit, number 35. Spirit has a plan, so you are divinely protected, guys. Look at that, Gemini. This is such a good start. And number 43, our spirit, you see clearly now. Wow, beautiful energies. Let's start with your tarot energies. And don't forget, these are free general readings. I'm recording here for YouTube. Some of the messages may resonate, some of them may not. Claim and take what resonates. You can leave the rest. That's totally fine. This reading is still for you. Not all messages have to resonate with you, Gemini. And you can always check out the reading of your moon, your Venus, and your rising sign as well. And there's also the possibility to purchase a private paid reading with me. The link to my Etsy store is in the description box. So let's see, two of wands, the two of cups, the knight of pentacles, the king of wands, and the nine of cups. The two of pentacles. So we have triple two already. Two of wands, two of cups, two of pentacles. The magician, I was just expecting that to be honest. When I saw that lizard card, I was like, oh, magician energy. And here it is. The world, my God, Gemini, this is so powerful. Wow. The artist and the page of ones, guys. Eight of ones at the bottom of the deck. Let's take that one here as well. And this is a fast moving energy, rapid changes coming in into your life. So what I'm seeing here is that you're really looking forward. You're really looking forward to the next chapter, to new adventures, new projects. I feel like creativity is really, really flowing for you. You've got the artist energy, you've got the magician energy. And I don't know where to start. This is so powerful, Gemini. I really love seeing that for you guys. Um, I just wanted to say, be really careful what you're wishing for, because you are like spirit has a plan. You got this one as well. You are favored by the divine. What you want to manifest will happen and it will come into your life really, really fast. So, oh my God, I'm getting goose, goose gums. No goosebumps. This is so exciting, honestly, guys. So let me see. The two of ones is really like looking forward, wanting to move on, right? We have the two of cups here and the knight of pentacles right next to it. So I really feel like you've got a very strong partner at your side, a very loyal and faithful partner. And this could be, if you're on a relationship already, this could be your, um, your lover, your partner, right? For others of you, this is a friend who's very, very loyal, who helps you push forward um, business partnership could be possible as well. And for others of you, if you're single, there could definitely be a new relationship coming in for you. Probably with an earth sign could be a bit younger than you. Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo doesn't have to be. The Knight of Pentacles is just very, very loyal. Okay. This is such a good, good friend and your side. And even though if you're a lovist, 
at the same time, this is a friend. Okay, very beautiful. The King of Wands energy here with the Magician and with the Artist. Describe your energy. And the Artist, you might be like, the Artist? This tarot deck has two um, additional cards, not optional, <laughs> two additional cards. And the Artist is one of them. And it's amazing because whatever you want to create, you are the artist of your life, the magician. You are creating your dream life right now with passion, with action oriented energy, like rarely seen, okay? So that's why I'm saying you're definitely favored by the divine Gemini. What is it that you want? Do you want to move abroad? Do you want to move somewhere else? Do you want to go on a journey? We have the world here, right? Do you want, yeah, there it is. Do you also want to get married? Do you want a new partner, um, a new relationship, or maybe you want to take it to the next level? It will become reality for you with this tarot reading, with these cards, with this deck, absolutely amazing. Nine of Cups is also reminding you. So yeah, so the Nine of Cups has a few different meanings, right? Of course, the Nine of Cups is taking good care of yourself, putting yourself first, but it also reminds us of, of how far we've come. The Ten of Cups is like this extremely emotional fulfillment, right? And with the Nine of Cups, we're almost there. We're almost at the end of our journey or of this particular journey because life is made of journeys, right? But the Nine of Cups is also reminding us, take your time, look how far you've come, um, be proud of yourself, but you know, just 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 take this time and and don't forget about this, okay? Because you have put in the work, you have put in the effort, and now you're going to be rewarded. Yeah, we have the page of ones here as well. Again, this new fresh energy, um, this action, this passion, um, also this inspired energy. Like there's a flame. Um, inside of you a new spark and with the two of pentacles I really feel like you guys this is not a negative card in your reading this is like you will easily balance out the things okay I really feel like you're extremely powerful at the moment you know what you want you know where you want to go and you will easily balance out the struggles balance out the energies and things are going to happen for you really, really fast with the Eight of Wands energy here. So change is happening, change is coming in. Let it happen, go with the flow. This is what comes with the Eight of Wands as well because things are happening fast and sometimes it can be scary, right? Let's find out more details, Gemini. This is the Mistral's Tarot Divine Guidance Oracle deck. And let's see some more details for you guys. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. The person that has been on your mind a lot is thinking about you too. Trust the path and believe in yourself. You will soon receive an important message. Yes, yeah, so there's communication coming in maybe from this person you're thinking about a lot because this person is thinking about you too, okay? Take it how it resonates. It doesn't have to be romantic. It can be romantic though. There is more to this situation than it seems. It may be difficult right now, but it is a blessing in disguise. Oh yes. Clarity and truth coming in for you guys. It's already on its way to you. The universe will catch you, take a step forward. Yes, so it's definitely like the time to, to conquer, to start your project, start this new chapter in your life to go for what you really want, right? Let's check out some shamanic healing cards. Let me grab that one. So what caught my eye is this card grounding, 36. 
And yeah, it does resonate with the feeling I've got here in your reading from the Nine of Cups. Um, take a step back and, you know, just look how far you've come and don't forget how much work you put into this, okay? 31 omens popped out for you. Number 28, anger. Number 24, ascension. Number 16, masculine energy. And number 15, honoring your energy. All right. Now let's check out some angel answers oracle cards. I'm not going to ask a specific question. If you have a question on your mind, there might be answers coming out for you with this oracle deck. Energies for Gemini, please. Angel answers energies for Gemini. Forgiveness. Yes. And look for a sign. All right, and now we're going to check out some Romans angels for you too. Romans angels for my Geminis. Let's see. There is, wow, there is, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. So if you're on a relationship right now, this is the one, definitely look at this soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. For others of you, if you're single and, sorry, if you're single, this could mean that you already know the person you're going to be with, but you're not together yet. But we also have past life relationship. You have known each other before and the soulmate card. So what I'm seeing here in the love department, this future love or the love you have right now is definitely a very deep connection, past life connection. If you believe in that, we have a soulmate connection, maybe even twin flame connection for some of you. Children, your love life is being affected by children. Well, this could mean a lot of different things. Maybe you want to become parents with your person. Um, Moving on to the next chapter, maybe you're working with children, maybe the future person is working with children, maybe like a teacher or in the kindergarten. Um, yeah, so take it how it resonates for you. Children will be somehow somewhat important in your love life. We have retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others and passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Nice, a lot of fire energy here. Last but not least, I'm gonna draw one card from the Lover's Oracle deck. And these cards are really hard to shuffle and I'm extremely, extremely clumsy. So <laughs> I will close my eyes, use my left hand, my intuitive hand. And I will draw one card for you guys, for my Geminis out there, okay? So let's see, we have this beautiful card. Life is a series of constantly shifting cycles. Oh yeah, I just said something like that and you're reading, scary. When we resist change, we resist the natural flow of life and create unnecessary stress. Go with the flow. You will be surprised where it leads and go with the flow. We have the eight of ones here. Definitely is a message for you, Gemini. <clears throat> also regarding your love life. Okay. So all in all, I really have to say, guys, um, I do see this fire coming back into your life, this passion, this lust for life, this going for it, action oriented energy, guys. You have such an amazing energy, powerful energy to create, to get where you want to be. I do see journey for some of you guys moving abroad, maybe even for others of you, I see marriage coming in. I see that you guys have a soulmate at your side. If you're single, um, you will meet this person um, very soon. And all in all, these are just amazing, amazing energies. I mean, you have the lizard, you have the magician, you have the artist, you have everything, you have the resources to 
um, to go for it and to create the dream life that you want. And as I said, be careful what you're manifesting with this energy. Wow. Really nice, Gemini. Thank you so much. If you want to support me, please leave a thumbs up. You can leave a comment as well. And of course, I would be very happy if you became a subscriber. And I do see you next time. Bye, guys. Thank you. Love y'all.